How's it going boys? Johnny Superb Man here bringing you another shootout commentary. That's right. And this time I'm going to use a team I, I don't think I've ever used in any shootout commentary versus commentary going back to NHL 11. And the reason I don't use these guys, I just I don't know too much about them. I really don't watch them ever. But they made some big splashes in the free agency this year. Well, they signed uh, Yarmir Yager in free agency, but actually trades, that's what the big thing was. And that team is the Dallas Stars. They traded for Derek Roy. They picked, it, uh, they picked up Yarmir Yager. And I want to talk a little bit about the Dallas Stars. So hang on a second. This guy's using a, what is he using? Come on, use an NHL team. There you go. All right. Now, the Dallas Stars, interesting team. Again, I don't know too much about them, right? But here's the thing. I, I Like, the last three years, I'm pretty sure the last, hang on a second. Uh, Ryder... Uh, where's Ribeiro? I know he's traded to, um, Washington, but he's got some slick hands. Morrow, I thought this guy was going to be traded. Adam Burrish, no, we don't need you in there. We got Ryder in there. Jamie Ben's like fifth? What are you... Oh my god, hang on a sec. Let me get Ben in there. Is there anyone else? <coughs> oh, excuse me. Holy crap. Um... No, that's it. And then Kari Letton in the, in, the, uh, in the cage. But yeah, but like the Dallas Stars, the last three years, man, they've had a winning record. I think three years ago, they had like 88 or 89 points. Two years ago, they had like 95 points and they missed the playoffs, which is crazy. I mean, like, Jesus, the Leafs had 95 points. That'd be great. 95 points and you missed the playoffs last year. I mean, uh, two years ago. And last year, they had another winning record. I think they only had 89 points last year. So what the hell? I mean, these guys are on the door just knocking, trying to get in. And the Western Conference, man, now you got the Minnesota Wild who look like they're going to be pushing for a playoff spot. The Dallas Stars have made a, a, an announcement to the NHL saying that, hey, we're trying to make the playoffs, signing uh, Yarmir Yager and trading for Derek Roy. So in the Western Conference, hang on a sec, Ribeiro. Um, oh, this guy's got hands. Let's do something fancy. Woo! Yeah! Woo! Oh, 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 go back. Oh, I tried to wait for him to go back. I should have just gone. You didn't admit. I, oh, wide open. Ah, my bad, my bad. Well, that's why I got traded to Washington. But my question to you Dallas fans is, if you guys are going to make the playoffs, and this is for actually everyone, if you guys are going to make the playoffs, who in the Western Conference is now going to fall out? All right? Because only, oh, flag poke check, because only eight teams can make it, right? I'm thinking the Nashville Predators may not make the playoffs this year. I know it's only Ryan Suter. But um, that's <laughs> only Ryan Suter. That was one of their best players on the team, right? And their team seems to be in... Uh, what are you doing? He doesn't want to watch the replay? I'm trying to talk right here. All right, I'm going to watch this right now. Flying poke jig over and over again. But the Nashville Predators losing Ryan Suter. And also, I, I don't know. I, I, could th I think Shea Weber may be on the trading block. Because what? Is the GM of Nashville going to let uh, Weber, the same thing happen to Weber as happened to Suter this year? You can't just let Shea Weber walk away from your team. You've got to trade. If he's not going to sign, all right, you've got to trade him away and get something back for him. So... What's going to happen in the Western Conference? Who's going to fall out? I think I think the Nashville Predators could fall out. I really think that the San Jose Sharks, one of these years, they're going to fall out as well. Hang on a sec. Spinorama, baby. Back forehand. Oh, my God. I keep running into the goalie. God damn. Um, so... That's the thing, Dallas. If you guys are going to make the playoffs, and I think you can, because you guys have been knocking on the door, and it seems like every year Dallas gets off to a great start, and then somewhere along the line in the regular season they go into a big slump, which ruins it for them, all right? But Dallas, that, well, there's that question for you guys. If you guys are going to make the playoffs, who's going to fall out of the Western Conference, all right? Because somebody's got to. In my opinion, I think St. Louis, uh, L.A., and even Minnesota are the new up-and-comers, and even Edmonton. They're right around the corner as well, all right? But I think uh, San Jose, hang on, drag, baby. Oh, oh, come on, no! Oh, my God! Open that glitch. Is that Jamie Benn? That's why he was number five. God damn. <laughs> whatever, whatever. I should have shot to the middle. My own fault. My own fault. Fair enough. Um... I think the San Jose Sharks are going to fall eventually. I think the Nashville Predators, you know, I think they'll, those guys are going to be in tur uh, turmoil now. Uh, Radulov is back in the KHL. I don't think Kostitsin is going to have a home there anymore after the stunt that he pulled with Radulov. Or there's going to be heat around him. All right. I only see San Jose and the uh, Nashville Predators falling out. And the, all the other six teams, I think they stay up there. So the Western Conference, man, it's going to be competitive once again. Hang on. Let's do a nice little move here. Here we go. Here we go. Boom, baby. Ah, oh, I would have missed the net anyways. Whatever. Oh my god, I haven't scored a goal here. My god, I gotta sit down and concentrate this. Alright, hang on. Enough talking about the Western Conference and the Dallas Stars. Here we go. Hang on. I gotta make sure I save this. Who is this? Number 36? Who is this? Who is that? I don't even know. Stalberg? Bolin. Bolin. Here we go. Flying poke check? I think so. Oh, yes! <laughs> very nice. Very nice. If it's good for the goose, it's good for the gander. That's. I deserve that, man. I had a wide open net as well. We got a tie game here. Four shots apiece, no goals. All right, Brendan Moore. And I thought this guy was going to be traded as well. He's getting old, kind of like a Shane Doan for the uh, Dallas Stars. Here we go. Here we go. 
Here we go. Woo! Oh, oh my god, I skate right into him! God damn! Oh, the why I skated right into him. Oh my god, what is wrong with me in this shootout? I'm doing some stupid ass moves. Alright, who is this? Patrick Sharp? Fake flying poke check. Don't worry, boys. I'm not gonna lose. I can't lose. I'm not gonna lose. Fake flying poke check. Here we go. Whew. Yeah, there you go. Easy save. Alright, we gotta put one in. Jackass shot? I think I might have to do it, boys. I think I might have to do a jackass shot. I know, I know. You hate it, but I gotta get a goal here. Hang on a sec. You know what? Burrish? Is he right-handed? He is right-handed. Gordy Howe, baby. Let's do the Gordy Howe with Burrish. Here we go. He's probably gonna dive at me and I won't get it. There we go. Oh my god, it's wide open! It's wide open. Put it in the net. Oh, two wide open net misses. A three if you count his. Holy crap. I mean, it is Adam Burrish. Fair enough. Sarcillo. Carcillo. Oh, I hate this guy. I hated him when he, when he was on Philly. Flying poke. Nope. Get out of here, son. Kari Lettinen. You guys definitely have a goalie who can play for you. I mean, I know Kari Lettinen. Um, I don't know if he's... Again, I don't know too much about Dallas, but I know he's a good goalie. Surround him with the right defense. I know he's a good goalie. Trevor Daly, here we go. Speaking about good defense, here we go. Here we go. What do we got? What do we got? Jackass shot time. Patrick Kane shot. Patrick Kane shot. There you go. Put it in the net. We got to end this. <laughs> Defenseman with that kind of hands? Are you kidding me? Look at this guy with his manual saves. And you guys will love how the goalies act in... Uh, I think they actually released it so I can talk about it now. I'll make a video about it. But there's no more manual saves. That's all I'll say. All right? But the right stick, actually, you can use it for something now. So you'll probably like that in NHL 13. I'll figure out if I can talk about that or not. I'll make a video about it. Here we go. Burn, uh, brunette. Oh, I got to do the flying poke check to end it. I've got to. I've got to. No. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, this game is great. This game is great. Yeah, okay. I can't wait for 13. <laughs> Twice he missed a wide open net. So there you go, Dallas. I kind of got away from what I was talking about. Look <laughs> Not even off the post. He just clearly missed. Oh my god. Whatever. I love it when it happens to other players. It happens to me way too often. So there you go. So Dallas, I'll put the question to you guys once again. If you guys are going to make the playoffs, who made the playoffs in the Western Conference last year that's going to fall out? I say San Jose. It's about that time where they're going to start to do worse. All right. Maybe not this year, but I don't know. I'm going to put my money on San Jose and definitely Nashville falling out of the Western Conference. All right. And maybe even Phoenix if Shane Doan doesn't come back. But they did pretty good this year. So we'll have to see. All right, boys. So let me know. For Johnny Superman and the Great Domsky, take it easy, boys. And we'll see you next time.